Hey guys, what's up? My name is AY. I'm a stand-up comedian, make people laugh for a living. We're in Atlanta again. We were here before, and then it was 30 days in Atlanta. So we're back again, and this time is a trip to Jamaica. And the journey starts from here. Love you to the point. Boom! All right, sound ready? Sounds ready. Roll sound, camera ready? Sounds big, baby. How did the idea for this thing go? We wanted to do part two of 30 days in Atlanta. I what I call you in this program. You know, when you do uh, the first film and you have too many stars in one film, try to get all these stars with their schedules. And, uh, it's very difficult. So we're facing one of those problems. Yeah, a lot of people are still waiting for the sequel. Saturdays days in Atlanta, yeah, but I also came up with the, with the idea and the decision of doing something different before we do the sequel for 30 days in Atlanta, and that turned out to be a trip to Jamaica. Actually, I worked on 30 days in Atlanta as a script supervisor, um, a course, aka AY, <laughs> called me up and said, hey Diane, I'm thinking of doing another um, not necessarily a sequel, but another adventure of Akos and I want to go to Jamaica and I think that you would be one of the best persons to work on this with me because you're a Jamaican. I couldn't stop laughing when he called me and told me exactly what he wanted and how he wanted to play it out and I scripted it for him and he loved it and I loved it and we went back and forth. Um, and it's just beautiful, it turned out very beautiful and I'm really excited. As soon as Diane wrote the first 15 pages, I said, no, I gotta make this film. So this film is one of those films that I have been waiting to make. Even me as a filmmaker, I really look forward to watching this film. Apos! Apos! Yeah. See me! Oh boy! Angel, huh? this is the Garden of Eden. <laughs> The character Akbos is, uh, is synonymous with adventure and my research also confirmed the fact that Jamaicans love African movies, they love Nigerian movies, they love Nollywood. I started putting the story together and then as usual you must get a professional uh, script writer, you know, to, to, to polish the script, to give the story uh, that uh, very little sense of direction. And that was how we got uh, by Andreas and um, to Jamaica and uh, we're enjoying the trip to Jamaica. Boss, you, you think fake imitation designer bags, they finish me. You go they promise my man for what Saturday you go buy a Louis Vuitton. You, I Me, promise on the mess I go buy a Louis Vuitton. What I see for what Saturday? Hey, I promise I go buy on the Louis Vuitton bag. Eh? Make a nickel bar for my trip. Who be fool you, Chris? Now like this, you will go back. You go cut up like some shit. We are go back before. You say that, Chris? Yes. Okay, when I first got the script. And I read it, I saw a crazy girl in Bola. I saw a crazy Yoruba girl, you know, from the ghetto. And I thought of it, how am I going to play this character different from Jennifer? Everybody knows Jennifer as a crazy, witty character. You know, they laugh. She's, she's, she's always speaking this a funny English, you know. And I just thought of it, what, what can make this different from Jennifer? Okay. Bola is going to be crazy. She's going to speak better than Jennifer. She's weird, but she's, I think she's, she's a little bit, a little bit more educated than 
Jennifer so I thought of it this is a good character for me I love it I want to do it I want people to be happy I want them to laugh and have fun when I read the script um, for a trip to Jamaica I loved every single character in it I started to find a thread that would link me to Abigail the character I sort of just realized that there's a little of Abigail in everyone you want something so you'd be patient and just stay for something. It could be love, it could be money, it could be anything, but you'd stay for something. Women are known to stay for something. So yes, I, I, I said to myself, I would do Abigail and I wanted to be Abigail and I had to assume the role and the character of Abigail and it was amazing. Yeah. What was that all about? Nothing. Can't I have a conversation with my sister? Do not lie to me. You're obviously upset. Of course I'm upset. I feel like a prisoner in my own home. Abigail, you stop all this damn drama. You knew exactly what you were getting into when you married me. If I knew what I was getting into when I married you, I would have hopped on the next bit to Nigeria. <gasps> this film, A Trip to Jamaica, is in the, um, the vein of the adventure of Akpos. And uh, it was nice. AY saw my performance and um, talked to Robert Peters, our, our director, and said, I think Dan would be perfect for this rich, uh, snobbish um, jerk of a guy, which is kind of a backhanded compliment because I am a jerk. And Robert said, sure, this sounds great. And it's been an amazing experience. Um, part of it was filmed in Nigeria, part of it in Atlanta, uh, Georgia, USA. And now we're in Jamaica finishing the film. So it's been amazing. It's been, it's been great. That is why you will suffer the consequences for your witless acts. I uh, thought it would be interesting um, the way it was described in the film. Uh, brilliant writing, might I add. It seemed very frivolous uh, from all of the other characters that I've done before. So I like that, you know, and it's not been anything like that in anything that I've done. So I welcome them. From 30 Days in Atlanta, I, I learned that our crossover movies is something that uh, our people want to see back home. They want to be part of it. They want to see culture blend. So, because 30 Days did it, I, I thought it would be nice to have that blend again. So you see, uh, let's see how it's going to be Nollywood, Hollywood, and of course, the Jamaican movie industry. I'm genuinely sorry, ma'am, but something just happened and Aquas is in a lot of trouble. Ah, uh ah, -uh, I know it's in your trouble. You are the one cooking the pot of trouble. You are staring my Aquas inside. Eh? Oh, you think I don't always see you people at the beach hugging and kissing? Husband snatcher! Indian baby doll, I shall wash she. When AY told me, okay, we'll be going to Atlanta, Jamaica, I was it? You know, I'm going to Jamaica. I want to see what it's like. You know, I see it as the words like vacation, and it's actually like that. It's been fun all the way. Um, I was actually filming in Cape Town, and my character was quite depressed in a way, and was very internal. So when Ayo Macron called me, Ay, I I thought to myself, ah, a bit of comedy would be good. Now, little. Our rooms has all the necessary facilities to make your stay a memorable and comfortable one. You will also have access to internet service, breakfast, 24 hours power supply, full air condition, free international calls, free tire pumping service, and free car battery charging. So, what are you waiting for? Quickly visit First View Luxury Hotel. We are located at number one at Daniel Bamishili Rajirazaki Road, First Estate, Amuwa Odofin, First Stack, Lagos, Nigeria. For inquiries and reservation, you can call or chat us on WhatsApp on this number 080 Eight seven one three five or zero eight zero triple nine double zero six zero one US local number one three four seven four six four six eight seven four First View Luxury Hotel. Your satisfaction is our concern. So come experience the home of comfort. Oh yeah! Afro Ojujum, Bonanda Nazo Aya Afia, Wele Obiawoli.